this book has a subtle thesis, a subtle argument, and that subtle argument is that these seven New Testament letters are interconnected. Um, I, I have written an academic monograph. It's a different book, um, and if, if you need help going to sleep, maybe you could read it uh, because it's much more academic. But it's making the argument that the early church uh, received these seven letters together and that we have all kinds of evidence, like manuscript evidence, that leads us to see that these seven letters were collected together in manuscripts and then circulated around in the early church and read together, similar to the four Gospels that were collected together, uh, actually put in a book of the four Gospels, and that book of the four Gospels circulated around in the early church. Same with Paul's letters. So in the academic guild, uh, it's a much more difficult argument, and a smaller group of us are working on this idea that the Catholic epistles also were a collection and should be read together. In, in this book, I'm trying to present to the church, uh, here is a way of seeing these seven letters, of course, as Christian scripture and as a part of the New Testament, but these seven letters have particular thematic connections uh, in two ways. You can see uh, key words and uh, repeated phrases that actually link those seven letters together, but then you can see themes that run all the way through. So, for example, one of the themes that come up in text boxes all the way through the main text, and then the last chapter outlines it a bit more, is the idea of love, love of neighbor, the, the love command from Leviticus. This is a command, this is a concern that shows up uh, throughout all seven of the Catholic epistles. And if you kind of, instead of reading down uh, James, 1 Peter, 2 Peter, if you read across, you can actually see where the love command connects uh, all the way through the seven letters. Uh, and I'm hoping this is a helpful way uh, that, that the church could engage these, these letters and then learn this uh, theology, learn these, uh, these key themes that they are uh, communicating. Hey, thank you so much for checking out this video clip from the Delgado Podcast. To get more videos like this, simply subscribe here on YouTube. You can also download the full episode of each show on iTunes, Spotify, Google Play, or your favorite podcast player. Take care.